Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Fishing the Mitten. Check it out. We finally got some Fishing the Mitten shirts. We got quite a few different colors and I think they turned out freaking awesome. We're going to be wearing these in tournaments. We're going to be giving some away. And if you guys like the design, I mean, it's pretty sweet fishing the mitten. So anyone that fishes in Michigan, it, it applies for. So if you guys think these are sweet, we can start selling them. But we do have a couple extra that we're going to give away for you guys. So stay tuned for those videos. Um, I think we have about four or five shirts that we're going to be giving away, which these are really nice shirts. So with that being said, we're going to go downtown, try and get some small and large mouth. Uh, it should be a pretty decent day. It's over, overcast conditions, which is really good for smallmouth. We're probably going to be throwing some swim baits, uh, some probably, probably some jigs, but we should at least catch a couple bass today. So stay tuned, guys. Should be freaking awesome. <laughs> Check that out guys on the swim bait. Came out behind some brush and he caught it. Came off this little swim bait. I'm gonna let him go now. Another one. That one's peeling drag. Woo! That's a big one. <laughs> Guys, check this smallie. Ow, that thing fought like crazy. Woo. Let's rinse them off real quick. Check that smallie out. That's a nice smallmouth right there. Woo. It's a tough guy. Let's let him go. Let's get a better release on him this time. <laughs> Woo. Yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> guys, the way I was swimming that swim bait, I'm keeping my rod tip up so you guys can see. Um, I'm just very slowly reeling it in. I felt that fish hit it once, so I slowed my retrieval down. And on the second one, he completely engulfed it. And I'm just keeping that rod tip up so that so that swim bait swims right above all those rocks and stuff and then oh see right there I just got a little hit. And I've got a weight on the bottom of this hook, so when I hit a rock, it's very clear because that um that uh that lead will there there's one. Oh yeah. There's another one. 
<laughs> we are just smoking them right now, guys. And these are all very good sized bass. I'm gonna catch a limit today. Look at that. Absolutely smoking that swim bait. That swim bait's doing work today. It's got a little bit of purple in there. Another small jaw. Woo, he wants to go home. See you, bud. Freaking awesome, guys. All right, so let's keep on going with this tip. So as I was saying, well, I got that fish interrupted me there, which I do not mind. I'm keeping that rod tip straight up in the air. And it's just a slow retrieval. There's one. Oh my gosh, he broke me off. Oh my God. Wow. That must have been a big fish, guys. Holy smokes. I'm gonna tie back up and get back in there. That was a big fish, man. Dang it. All right, get back to you guys in a bit. Hey guys, I'm rigged back up. Can't even get a good tip in for you guys without getting a fish. That's how hot fishing is right now, but whatever bit that just absolutely destroyed it. I really wish I wouldn't have broken, broken off in his mouth because now there's no way I'm gonna get him to bite. So as I was saying, rod tip up, steady, very steady retrieve. When you bump on those rocks, give it like a little bit of a twitch. Sometimes that can be the last little bit. That's the last little thing that will trigger these fish. There's a fish. Heck yeah. It's not the big one we lost, but still another nice, nice uh, largemouth. Checker. I think that's the fifth or sixth bass of the day. Let her go. There we go. Oh, there's one. Oh, there's a fish. Woo. Heck yeah, guys. That was an awesome bite. Good strong hit. Felt him very easily. And that's just a little dink. The hard one, the big ones are even easier to to get the hook on. So let's get him back.
I just randomly threw this swim bait on and it's actually doing quite well. Let's get back in there. All right, guys, it's time to move spots. We're gonna let this spot <clears throat> rest up a little bit. There's always fish moving through here. Whenever you're fishing a river, guys, and the fish aren't in their spawning mode yet, they're always moving, especially in the springtime when they're looking for bait fish and just looking for food in general. They are always moving, so we gotta keep moving too. Gonna be a little risky here. Gotta risk it for the bass. Boy. Just waiting for one of these little rocks to give out. I'm digging this spot, y'all. Guys, when I'm having guys, when I'm having a really, really good day of fishing, I always like to switch it up and try and try different lures out. Obviously, I've been catching them like crazy with that little Kitek I was swimming, but now I'm going to try a built-in hook swim bait and see if see if they'll eat this just as well. So, that's what we're going to throw for a little bit and We'll see how we do. <sighs> Son of a gun. Holy cow, this is a fish. What is this thing? Guys, I got a fish on. Holy smokes, what is this thing? Woo! Oh, big old, big old, big old carp. Holy cow. Jeez thing scared me. I thought it was a pike. I kind of wanted to break them off, but like get them, like not break off my lure, but don't feel like grabbing him. Oh. There he goes. Whew. Get out of there, bud. Golly. How's that for the first cast? <laughs> All right, guys. So when I caught that bass, there was two other ones following it. So what you gotta do, <laughs> got some hair in my mouth. You gotta switch up that bait for the next cast. So. I'm gonna sneak up on these guys. Make a cast. Oh, I just got hit. There's one. <sighs> All right, so these bass are clearly either getting getting ready to spawn or are in the process. <clears throat> Cause I have to cast right into that grass patch to get them to come out and smoke it. Another nice large, you guys. We're absolutely crushing them today. Let him go.
there's one. Yes. See that, guys? I was able to irritate them just enough. I think I swam that bait through there about four or five times, and I was just dropping it right on his bed. And this is clearly the male. It's way small, way smaller than the other ones I was catching. Careful there, bud. I'm gonna put my rod down real quick. <clears throat> And there he is, little buck. He's gonna go back and do what he's got to do. Keep it freaky, friend. All right, so we've caught three of them. <clears throat> I think we got all three of them. Uh, I caught one and I saw two others following it up. And now I caught those other two. And at first, I, I'll show you guys the clip, but I was fishing here with that green one hook swim bait and I fished for about five minutes and then I moved on I said ah oh, there's no fish here until I finally put on my my good swim bait and I came back and I was like there's got to be some fish in here there's one. Oh yeah Get over here, bud. See, and there's even more. There's even more fish in there. The spot is stacked. Take that hook out. Ouch. go hooks out absolutely scrunched it and that my friends is another LMB let's get them back go do your thing freaky freak Woo. we're putting a hurting on these guys today This little son of a gun is doing all the damage today, so. Thing, that thing freaking hit it like top water <laughs> oh my gosh that's a smallie right there boys Woo. that was an insane hit once again threw it right in that grass Threw it right in that grass. And that guy freaking came up and smoked that bait. That bait was literally like laying right on top of the of the grass there. And he came up and smoked it. So thank you, Lord, for this fish. And thank you, fish, for coming out to play. Oh my gosh, I actually hooked a big freaking fish. Wow, we guys, I didn't even think to turn my camera on because I didn't think there was gonna be a fish in here. But holy smokes, that is a beauty! That thing annihilated my swim bait. Ugh. Check them out. I'm gonna try and get a picture with this guy, so I'll be right back, guys. GoPro stop recording.
yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> wow, that's a big smallie. Wow. That is a big smallie, guys. Woo! Freaking awesome. Check them out. Nice two pound, two and a half pound smallmouth. Let's go ahead and get a release on them. There we go. Another bass, guys. On the swim bait. This one was pretty nice. It came out, came right out and smoked it. So that's three. That's three of them right here. He got scuffed up by something. Something bit him. But look at those chompers. He's ready. He's ready to go. Let's get him out of here. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for me today. Um, we did very well. We caught about 20 to 30 bass all on that swim bait or that uh, single hook bait that I was using. They were both swim baits, but um, yeah, like I said, stay tuned for the next video. I will be doing some giveaways for this shirt. If you guys like it, let me know. I can put some up for sale as well. Uh, with that being said guys, thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next video. Peace GoPro stop recording